Hey there YouTube, AJ here, and I'm in Gastonia, North Carolina, where I'm going to be trying to skate a pump track at 56 years old. Let's try it. Alright, so, so far, I don't even know where to start. The bad news is, it's still kind of wet. I guess we'll go over and try to skate that side. It looks drier. I don't know. I don't know how this is going to go. Uh, it's the, the pump track is asphalt I think this thing's made mostly for bicycles I don't know I've seen people online skate this thing but uh, trying to figure out the lines here in this corner there's that yellow start box and in the far corner over there there's one to, as well so I'm guessing those are the starting points I think it looks so if we go this way down. I think it looks fairly symmetrical as there's two tracks. Looks like you go down. I'm not positive. We're just gonna we're just gonna set up and play and see what happens. The asphalt is still wet in places and it's slick. Uh, I've got hard wheels. I may not have the right setup for this kind of track. I think I need something with a lot softer wheels, bigger wheels. So this might be like an experiment and we'll have to come back later after and get with a different setup. But we're gonna give it a few shots at least. Trying to learn to pump too, so that's this is really hard. So I think what my goal, immediate goal should be is just to get used to pumping. And I think this little section in the middle seems to be driest. So I think what I, my goal should be is to drop in here, pump to that bank curve down there, right around one way or the other, I don't know which yet. Probably that way will be easier, I think. Because of this transition right here but anyway go try to make it back up to here without having to push I don't know if I can do that it's gonna take a while all right I guess that wasn't half bad effort for the first time I do have another setup in my car with uh, bigger wheels. I think I'm gonna run and get that though. All right, so this setup, Santa Cruz deck, it's got 58 millimeter wheels on it. They're still hard wheels, so they're gonna be slippery and they're brand new. The other problem is this has DKL grip tape on it which with my feet being wet, it's kind of slippery. So I don't know if it's gonna be any better or not. Yeah. 
I don't think I can make this work until things dry out a bit because my feet are just going to be sliding around. So back to the old Andy Anderson. Alright, so I got a little bit of pumping there. I got further around that time. Actually, I felt like I was going pretty fast. I need to learn to pump through that curve. I have lots of speed going into it, but I'm losing speed coming out of it. All right, I'm gonna try one more time this way, then we're gonna try the other side again. Gonna try the other side. All right, so I was coming up this bank turn over here and had a bunch of water in the bottom of it. So I tried to go high on the bank. I totally slipped out and did the splits. That wasn't fun. Let's see if we can get you a wider angle here. Props to the dudes that can pump these things and never slow down, man. That's crazy. I mean, part of it's my inexperience, and part of it, I'm out of shape, and part of it, I'm old. I don't know. Lots of excuses, but I mean, it is my first time trying this shit. Alright, so I think I figured out the correct line through the entire track. I'm going to try to follow that line. Obviously, I don't have the skills to pump through it all without stopping and having to restart. So you're going to see me uh, stop and restart, or maybe I'll try to edit out those stops and restarts to make it look like I went through it one time smoothly.
one hole left. All right, let me tell you, even with stopping and starting, that was not easy. I'm gonna tr keep trying that a little bit more. Let's see if I can't try to make it a little further each section. kind of hurt. I feel like I tore my nipple off on the concrete. <sighs> Alright, so what happened there? I was actually coming in pretty fast. There's mud in the bottom of this turn. So I have to take it a little higher. And I basically have way too much pressure on my back foot. And uh, the dampness of the pavement, because this is all in shadow. So this is still damp in here. And I had too much pressure on that back foot and my back wheels just slipped out from under me. And uh, I was already leaned way over, I think. Maybe video will show that. But uh, yeah, I just came off the board like this into the side of this hill, right into the pavement. Drug my right nipple down along the uh, blacktop. That kind of hurt. But I'm not done yet. And I will say this, this is fun. And uh, I will be coming back here, but I'm gonna do a little research, figure out what is the best kind of setup to use in, on this kind of pavement and a pump track. But yeah, I will be back. I really, I am really enjoying this.
that time I got too heavy on my nose and I was going too slow. I couldn't get up the bank. But I made it so much further that time. I made it clear around the outside loop and into this bank. That's the furthest one I've done on my own yet. I have a feeling I might have kids on bikes coming. I hear, I saw a truck go by. I hear kids over there. Is my stuff gonna be in your way here? Cool. can't make it all the way around. Yeah. <laughs> it's a lot harder when you don't have pedals. Yeah, you're right. You're right. <laughs> and not a lot of weight to push around. Yeah. And you're 56. Yeah. <laughs> all right, so I just spent about an hour and a half here at the pump track. It is a blast. I will be setting up a board specifically for this and uh, coming back. It was too much fun. We're going to do some research and uh, See what kind of wheels I know I need probably need bigger wheels something a little softer I think for this pavement and uh, I do like the Andy Anderson shape on it so I'm just probably going to set up a Andy Anderson deck for it so this is the Poston Park pump track out near Gastonia North Carolina and it's a nice little track as it dried off it got better for me I got of course I got my best run where I made it almost a full half loop right when they put after the camera died so but we'll be back and until then later YouTube